Hello friends, welcome to Let's Tap. In today's video, I am going to explain you how you can calculate uh, nozzle marking distance for the dish nozzle and shell nozzle. In if you are working in a pressure vessel fabrication, you might be know that the nozzle marking is plays an important role during the pressure vessel fabrications or process equipment fabrications. So we have developed some tools to simplify your work and minimize time of your fabrications work. So let's move toward to know how you can calculate the uh, nozzle marking distance for the shell nozzle and descent nozzle. First of all, you have to open your mobile browser and type let's tab in a Google search term and click on the search button. When you click on the search button, Google will give some result to you and you will find the link for our homepage. Click on just the first link of this uh, our website let's tab dot in and it will open you to our homepage of our website. When you come to homepage of our website, you will find uh, menus button at the upper right corner of the our website. Click on the menu button, it will open some menus available with our website and find here is our app button and click on the our app menus. It will open you the page where lots of the app developed by the Let's Play app has been listed over there. You just scroll down below to find your today's school. Today's tool, name of this tool is Nozzle Marker nozzle orientation marker just find out here is this tool and here there are some options is available over there download app for android or apple device you just click on this button download app for android or apple device this app is available for both the android device and apple device here is a page where uh, information about this app has been listed over there you can read this and uh, when you scroll down below there are two links options are available there the one of is click here to download this app for android device and one other options is there click here to download this app for apple device so my device is uh, i have an android device so i am clicking on the click here to download this app for android device when you click on the link click here to download for android device it will open you uh, your google play store and display you the nozzle orientation marking calculator over there you just click on the install button in my case i have already installed this app that's why it's not showing the install button. In If you are not installed this app in your device, you will uh, get the option of your install button. Click on this install button, it will get download and you will see the open button over here. There. When you click on the open button, it will open this app and initially you will get uh, some welcome screen over there and it will, uh, uh, you have to wait uh, till some it, percentage were completing over the 100%. When this percentage are completing by 100%, it will open the home page of this app where the two options are available for nozzle marking distance calculation. First is for shell nozzle orientation marker and second is for descent nozzle orientation marking distance. Yani, uh, in this case, first uh, there are two nozzle marking distance are required while working on uh, pressure vessel fabrication. First for while working on shell nozzle, you have to know about uh, shell, mark, shell nozzle marking orientation marking distance and second is when you are uh, marking nozzle on descent, you must know about the descent marking distance for the nozzle. In this case, we have already given two options over there. First, we will see the shell nozzle orientation marking option. Just, I just clicking on the first option and it will open you uh, image for the understanding the notation of this calculator. Here is alpha is for locating angle of the or orientation angle of this nozzle and the another input is required for this app is shell outside circumference diameter. It, it's uh, OCF should be uh, an actual what you are measure on your shell outside circumference. You have to input that outside circumference over there. I'm for example, I'm just clicking here to 2500 mm as an oh, outside circumference of my shell and I am clicking as a, uh, inputting 45 degree as an angle. You have to keep in mind that while uh, entering the OCF of your shell, you have to enter it in mm and while uh, entering the angle of your shell, you have to orientation angle should be in a degree and when you uh, complete all the input details you just click on the calculate button it will give you some result about the nozzle marking distance it will in the result screen you will see that the input ocf whatever input you have given to this app that has been listed over there 2500 mm what we have given earlier and second is shell od or uh, on the basis of this OCF, it had calculated the shell actual OD of this uh, shell and the OCF for 1 degree is uh, 6.94, this is a distance for 1 degree and the second is OCF for 45 degree that is 312.30, this is the actual marking distance of your shell nozzle that you have to locate on your nozzle marking distance. This is uh, OCF for 45 degree, the actual nozzle marking distance for your 45 degree and it's also display the 1 degree. Um, 
मार्किंग डिस्टेंस सो दैट यू कैन मल्टीप्लाई विथ यूर अदर डिग्रीज और यू कैन जस्ट सिंपली चेंज यूर नोजल एंगल एंड अगेन क्लिक ऑन द कैलकुलेट बटन इट विल गिव द रिजल्ट टू यूर न्यू ओरिएंटेशन एंगल नाउ वी विल सी द सेकंड ऑप्शन ओवर नोजल ओरिएंटेशन मार्किंग डिस्टेंस आई जस्ट क्लिकिंग ऑन दिस बटन इट विल डिस्प्ले यूज द इमेज फॉर अंडरस्टैंडिंग द नोटेशन व्हाट आर द नोटेशन यूज इन दिस कैलकुलेटर हियर इज द डी यूज फॉर द डिशन डायमीटर सेकेंड सी इज यूज फॉर नोजल स्ट्रेट डिस्टेंस एंड ए इज आर्क डिस्टेंस दैट वी हैव टू कैलकुलेट और दैट इज एक्चुअल अवर रिक्वायर्ड नोजल मार्किंग डिस्टेंस and then below this image there is a input section are over there here you have to input outside addition outside diameter second is nozzle distance and then you have to select which type of distance you are going to mark the nozzle and for example i am taking distance as a 1250 mm distance outside diameter nozzle distance i am taking 250 mm and i am selecting the distance type of टोरिस्पेरिकल हेड और इज ऑल्सो सिमिलर टू द एफ एंड डी हेड इज कॉल एड टोरिस्पेरिकल हेड एंड आई एम जस्ट सिलेक्टिंग द टोरिस्पेरिकल हेड एंड क्लिक ऑन द कैलकुलेट बटन वेन यू क्लिक ऑन द कैलकुलेट बटन इट विल डिस्प्ले यू द वाट आर द क्राउन रेडियस फॉर यूर डिस्टेंस इज द वन टू फाइव जीरो एम एम एंड द नोजल आर्क डिस्टेंस इज टू फिफ्टी वन पॉइंट सेवेंटी सिक्स पॉइंट दिस इज नोजल आर्क डिस्टेंस एक्चुअली यू हैव टू रिक्वायर फॉर यूर नोजल ओरिएंटेशन मार्किंग और डिशेंट नोजल मार्किंग डिस्टेंस इज A that is two fifty one point seventy six. Here you have to just uh, cross verify that your crown radius is match with this crown radius. If your crown radius is vary with this, then the, this uh, nozzle marking distance may might be changed. That so that's why first you have to uh, cross verify that, that this crown radius is similar to your actual. Uh, Crown radius given on your drawings or actual crown radius, whatever you have, your drawings has been mentioned over there. So I am just clicking on the back button, and here there are two options that will very helpful you to while you are nozzle marking distance or nozzle marking orientation marking problems. You will easily simplify your work and you can minimize your calculation with the help of these tools. If you are looking for the similar calculators in the fabrication field, you can visit our app page where the lots of fabrication tools are available over there. You can use any tools free of cost with our website. You you just have to visit our website and use our tools. We also provide e-learning courses for precision fabrications. So you can also get the information about these our courses at our app page of the our website. If you find this video as informative, like our video, share with your friends, comment us, and subscribe our channel. Thank you for watching this video. Thank you.